everyone. It's Mandy Webkins, and I'm here with my co-host, Michael Webkins. Hi, Michael. Hey, Mandy. So it's Podkins 83. I know, and this is going to be a fun one. It is because, well, first of all, we're going to take a look at the marshmallow prizes, and I have done a pretty cool marshmallow room. Not Well, not marshmallow room, Rocky room. <laughs> Yeah, with it. the prizes that you could win from yes, the Marshmallow Collection. Exactly. Yeah. And then we're going to read a kid's post, and then we're going to look at some of the entrants in our postcard design contest. Pretty cool. Yeah, it's still going on as we record this, but I've chosen a few to uh, highlight today. And then you are going to quiz me and our guests, Sally and Steven. Hi, Sally yeah. and Steven. Hello. Hi there. Steven and Sally are in studio. They are in studio today. We live here. <laughs> <laughs> Let's start by checking out our Rocky Marshmallow Collection event prizes, which are really cool. I love that wallpaper, Michael. Yes, and actually, these prizes match the prizes that we gave away during last year's Marshmallow Collection, and both collection events ran from July 1st to 31st, so there's still time to finish your collection. And Mandy, you know what? I love these events because every single time you finish it, so you collect all 50 marshmallows and you get all those five prizes, it actually, you can reset your collection exactly. and uh, continue it to get more prizes. So don't leave it to last minute, guys, because uh, you're going to want to complete this more than once to really create an awesome uh, adventure room for your pet. And I love that volcano, by the way. Yeah, that volcano is available either on the W Shop or an e-store, and it complements the rest of the prize. Perfectly. Yeah, it costs e-store points, but it's an awesome addition to that room. And actually the cave, there was a really cool rocky cave yeah. that looked like a bear, I believe. And that actually, we first released it last year and it's still available this year as well. So you can check that out and uh, use your e-store points to get that one too. But Mandy, have you finished your collection? Already? I have. I've actually got a couple of multiples, which you're going to see because yeah, as you were saying, you can do it over again and get more items. So totally. you know what? Let's check out the room I designed. Now, you know what? You wow. know how I always like to steal ideas from our players who <laughs> sent in room designs? And a lot of our players have sent in these great rooms with the blue flag flooring that looks yeah. like water so i decided to use that for the flooring and of course we're all there and we're all wearing oh, cool. our campkins counselor outfit <laughs> very cool there sally you're it looks like you're having a dip in the hot springs there <laughs> well I'm, sally I'm could, dipping. <laughs> Sally couldn't wear the campkins counselor outfit because snakes have no arms so i thought I really she's ready <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I thought you were ready for the pool. Cool. And there you are, Mandy, inside the cave. Exactly. That's the bear cave that I was talking about. Exactly. Look at it. It's huge. It's awesome. I know. And it lights up when the pet goes inside. So, And there's Steven sitting on the rocks and Michael, you're <laughs> up on a bridge. And I think you're wearing shades. You, maybe you're both wearing shades. I very can't cool. Got to so, protect the eyes from the exactly. sun. It's very important. There's the uh, volcano in the back. Really cool. Yes. And actually, what is a resting volcano? Sally would know this. Dormant. Sally. Oh, dormant, is it? Anyway, yeah, but they, there's different states of this volcano. So if you click on it, actually, that's when it erupts and you can see the lava. So I'm glad that there's no lava here, nice and safe, because I'm pretty close. Yes, <laughs> you are. Maybe you're running away from the volcano right there. So uh, we also have a Kins post, don't we? So, Michael, do you want to read us our Kins post? Absolutely. All right. So this Kins post is from DJH89, and they say, hey, it's DJH89 here again. I absolutely love Podkins. I have a question, but I'm not sure if you can help me or not. I'm curious if the Hearts Collection event will be brought back again. I remember the Hearts Collection was only held one time, and I was really hoping it would be a yearly event like the Flower Collection and our other various collection events. Thank you for being so entertaining and fun. Your friend DJH89. Oh, well, that yeah. was so nice. Thank you. So the Hearts Collection, I believe that they're talking about is a Valentine's collection. And actually, I remember we, that one, yeah. Yeah, and actually we did have it this year. So maybe DJH89 might have been uh, away during February or, or something. Yeah, the collection events we, we do have and they do, are repeated every single year. You can access them from the Kinsville map. So they used to be in the room. Now they're in the Kinsville map. We're going to bring those back into the room. But for now, they're on the map. And uh, yeah, this year's Valentine's collection event, which ran throughout February again, you could collect uh, pieces that you could add to a chocolate shop. That's right. Yeah, and actually, the year before, we also um, released chocolate shop items. Yeah. But this year, it was more kind of, we had a booth and yep. a booth table. There was a window. Really, really cool An stuff. An animated so, booth. Yeah, really Yeah, so cute. just like the marshmallow collection, you know, sometimes year after year, the prizes match 
and you can actually use them to create an even uh, sort of larger themed room. So that's what we did with the Valentines. But next year, I think we're going to have to switch it up, come up with new prizes. So guys, if you have ideas what you want to see in that Valentine's collection event for prizes, leave them in the comment section below. Yeah. So we also are about to check out some of our postcard designs. It's still going on. So we these aren't the final uh, designs, but we're going to see some of the ones that I thought were pretty cool. Very cool. So what so what was this contest again? So we have postcards that you can send from Vacation Island and we included a template so that players would see the size that they had to work with because they're a vertical postcard. And when you're visiting Vacation Island, you can send postcards to your friends. Yeah, actually, Mandy, since we updated Kin's Post, Steve, right, you can now send postcards just from Kin's Post itself, right? Yeah, you don't have to go to the Vacation Ooh. Island, although I do believe that the postcard feature is for uh, deluxe players. Yes. But uh, yeah, if you can open up uh, your Kin's Post and see the tab there for postcards and send your friend a postcard from uh, anywhere in Webkin's world. So, Mandy, the winning design here is actually going to be made into a postcard that is going to be added to the game that anybody can send from exactly. uh, Kin's Post, right? Cool. And they get an apricot schnoodle, which are super <laughs> cute. They're, just That's just the icing on top <laughs> of the cake, know. right? Oh, they're so adorable. Yeah, apricot jelly. <laughs> Ooh, is that the, the PSF? The right, there you go. <laughs> So this one, this one looks awesome. Yeah. I recognize that guy. That's the pirate. You know, is it? The ghost pirate. Right, the ghost, ghost pirate <laughs> from from Don't Rock Your Boat. Yes, from the game. Don't on. Rock the Boat. In, uh, the uh, adventure. Uh, adventure Park. Adventure Park. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so this, I thought this was a really cool one. It's great drawing and land ho is pretty cool. So. Yeah, no, it's really, really well done. Yeah, and I love <laughs> this beach selfie because I love the way they've done the reflection of the beach in the glasses. I think that's so great. Absolutely. I love this one. You think this you need a cute. selfie stick for this? Yeah, you need, you need like a, a selfie stick in the other lens there and see the actual <laughs> camera in there. Cute. It's just really simple. I love I love the simplicity of it. So, Mandy, are, on, are we only going to be choosing one of these designs or are we going to choose several? We are going <laughs> to choose 10 finalists. Okay. And each of the runners up get a spa towel trolley. So the grand prize wow. winner gets the schnoodle and then right. each of the runners up get a spa because, you know, there's the spa on Vacation Island. So cool. it sort of made sense. So, yes, um, this this one's really pretty. This is really nice. Isn't it lovely? The silhouettes of the friends watching a sunset. Again, the simplicity of it really stands out. Yeah, they look so calm and relaxed. Yes. And this one is by Hannah Lee. Life is always better at the beach. And I agree, Hannah Lee, by the way. <laughs> it's such a cute, you know, simple beach scene. Yeah, and there's a little crab yeah, in there. Starfish. Really, really cute. Um, I love the sun, the way that they've drawn the sun there coming out of the clouds. Really, really nice. Yeah. We have lots of beach prizes, by the way, that you can win on Webkins, especially if you go to the Vacation Island. I know on the Vacation Island wheel, there's a beach tile that you can use and add to your room, which is pretty cool. And of course, Sheldon, his souvenir shack, he's yeah. always got a lot of stuff. And so. it changes, right? So Yeah, and we always see a lot of beach rooms, actually. People submit them to us all the time. Wow, look at this. It's really colorful. I know Love it. Monkey Fun 15, who I know has sent us cool stuff in the past. But uh, yeah, the Google diving, it's just really cool the way they've done the perspective there. Must be frustrating to see all that treasure and not be able to reach out and grab it, Mandy, <laughs> right? Google's having no arms. <laughs> well, maybe he'll use this beaker. That's true. <laughs> but look at that gem. Very cool. Oh, my and gosh. And look, I know I, both of these struck me because they both chose a similar theme. The Google, this one's going after a pearl. Maybe it's the same Googles, but on a different day. <laughs> See, but at least this guy's free diving, so you can at least pick exactly. up a pearl with his mouth. So uh, he's he's thought ahead here. <laughs> Giant yeah. pearl, too. Very cool. Yeah, isn't that neat? We have the game Adventures of the Crystal Sea. Yeah. Oh, sorry, Treasures of the Crystal Sea. Sorry, being corrected by Mrs. Cowline <laughs> over here. But those, those, that submarine that you see is from the game. Love that game, by the way. And again, it's only available on Vacation Island. Yeah, it's a fun yeah. game. So this one was, I, I thought it was really vibrant. The way they've drawn the water, it just looks really fun. And the colors they've used are really cool. The Cotton Candy Bunny postcard. I really like how they've sort of stylized our Webkin's bunny there to yeah. make it, give it their own style and their own kind of creativity to it. Really, really cool. Yeah. That really nice neat. drawing. I like the eyes. Yeah. 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 
And then this one was so much fun, the toad or frog cool. uh, going surfing. I just thought that was a really cute one by Tutina One. Yeah, so we have actually, we have a bunch of Webkin's figures that were available a few years ago, several years ago, but one of them was a surfing frog. So I think that they've actually used the pose oh, of that figure cool. for the frog there. And uh, is that a clouded leopard on there or just a cat? But it looks really cool relaxing there on the lounger. Yeah, and the sun in the foreground, really neat. These are all so well done. I I'm really, know. really impressed. Press. So colorful and bright. And uh, this is Midnight Fireflies. And again, I think it was so colorful, it really caught the eye. And they've just used a lot of elements from Vacation Island. They've got the ghost pirate there and Treasures of the Crystal Sea and there's yep. Sheldon. Yeah, dog beard. It's, oh, sorry. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I should put my glasses on. <laughs> uh-huh. But yes. Sheldon's souvenir shack there. (laughs) Yeah. It's a good thing that he's actually there because he tends to be kind of, you know, a little lazy sometimes. I don't know. They caught I, him when he was working. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I like uh, I like the sunset, the 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 colors of the sunset and how they've kind of created it reflecting on the water. Really, really yeah, great job, Midnight Fireflies. Really lovely. Yeah. And then this is our final one. And again, the colors. Everybody's using such great colors and the simplicity. The, this is, I think it was a pink and white cat in that selfie one. So Lots of it, sunsets. Yeah. Very, yeah, very cool. Beautiful. Again, yeah, like you say, the colors are awesome. Yeah, they really pop out. And again... I, it, it's a very simple design, this one. I like the line art here. So so great job, everybody. Those are some of our entries so far. But check in with us on the 18th on Webkin's News to see the 10 finalists because we'll want to hear your input. Yeah, good luck, guys. Stay tuned to Webkin's News to find out which one won. And now it is time for the quiz. And it's going to be Stephen versus Sally versus Mandy. So, guys, let's check our buzzers. Mandy. All right, Sally, check your buzzer. There you go. And Stephen, check yours. All right. (laughs) So now I love these quizzes because guys, you guys can play at home and let us know how you did in the comments section below. See if you can beat these guys, our experts. So are you guys ready? Yep. All right. Here is question number one. There's 12, by the way. So what was the grand prize you could win for collecting all six chocolates from cinnamon in the park? So this was at a Valentine's Day event. You visit Cinnamon in the park. You collect chocolates. Last year, it was a chair. Ah. Sally's going to give a guess. Uh, That race car that looked like the the, uh, St. Patrick's Day one. That is correct. (laughs) I'll give it to you. It was an actually lovely go-kart. So there you go, Sally. And of course, when you logged in on Valentine's Day, you got the suit and the helmet to match. So great job, Sally. You get a point. Here is our second question. So it's kind of a multiple choice question. Mod Mini... Silver boots or patterned yoga pants? Which piece of clothing was not part of this year's winter clothing line? Ah. Sally. Patterned yoga pants. Let's see if you are correct. You are correct. That's part of our current summer line. (laughs) There you, wow, Sally. Very good, love those pants. So, Sally, quickly in the lead here by two points. So here we go, here's our next question. What update did we make to challenges this year? This is kind of a tough question. (laughs) Um, wasn't a huge update, but I thought it was really convenient. Oh, I know. Sally? Mandy. You oh, <laughs> Mandy, sorry. <laughs> I'm just so used to saying Sally this time. No, Mandy, yes. You can see the challenges in different parts of uh, Webkin's world. Yes, yeah. exactly. So the challenges, those icons that are listed along the left side of your room there, they used to only be available in the room in the clubhouse and in the park, but now actually we've extended that all across Webkin's world so you can see them. So great job, Mandy. You just earned yourself a point. So here you go. Here's our fourth question. We released three new Vacation Island souvenirs on January 25th. Can you name one of them? Mandy, again. Is it that weathered coin table? It's all made of old (sighs) That was released the previous year. and Yeah, Yeah. but no, that's a good guess. Say there was some sort of uh, island shirt. Let's see, Stephen. I like that. Yep, you got it. It's a souvenir t-shirt. And we also released the comfy inner tube that your pet can sit in and beach toys. So there you go. (laughs) (laughs) Everyone's on the board. Sally's still leaving with two points. So which Webkin's host were you able to add to your friends list this year? Mandy. Well, there was more than one. 
right? No, this year oh. it was just a new one. <laughs> is it Sophie Stockwell? No, it's uh-huh. not. Sally. Fiona. That is right. It's Fiona Feathers. So there you go. Yeah, last year we could add several, but this year we only allowed you to add Fiona Feathers. And guys, you can add her when you send uh, Kin's post or you can type her name, Fiona Feathers, into your friends list and invite her that way. So there you go. Sally is on the board again with three points. Mandy, you've got one. Steven, you've got one. Now, here's our next question. We released a new super bed on February 15th. What was it? Dun, dun. What was the super bed? Super beds, of course, you guys, you can get um, when you adopt your 10th pet and every fifth after that, you get one of those gift boxes added to your dock. And you can choose the bed. Sally's going to take a guess at this one. The one that looks like a hockey puck. The yacht bed. <laughs> <laughs> yep, it the is. Oh, landing pad. Yeah, it, the hockey I puck. I was going to say that It's one, the cozy yacht older. bed. Yep, so there's the um, landing pad on top of the yacht that you're pecking <laughs> there. So really, really cool. Sally, you are doing really well here. So here's our next question. How old did Webkin's turn on April 29th? Mandy jumped right for this one. <laughs> we turned 12. Let's see if you're correct. Yes. Yay! It was our 12th anniversary. Amazing that it's been 12 years, but there you go. And it keeps on getting better and better. So here we go. Next question. We released one brand new arcade game this year. Do you know what it was? Well, we re uh, envisioned Cash Cow and Polar Plunge and we released them. Sally's going to try. At Party Parade? Pet Party Parade, let's take a look. Yeah! Sally, you are right. It was Pet Party Parade. We've um, released several new ones in the past couple of years. So this is a hard question. How do you think Dr. <laughs> Quack is doing of Merritt oh, oh, Kinzel? Oh, okay, Steven. Yeah. He's doing a fantastic job. Fantastic <laughs> job. Fantastic <laughs> job. And his Twitter handle, by the way, at MD underscore Quack is, you know, if you're on Twitter, you got to follow that guy because he's hilarious. There you go. So you can follow Dr. Crack on Twitter and Steven thinks he's doing a great job. I agree. Let's continue here. Here's a question. How many flowers did you need to collect to win a mod patio chair? Mandy. I think it's 20. Let's see if you're right. Yeah. Mandy, you are correct. 20. Get this really cool mod patio furniture set when you collected flowers through May. So there you go. You needed 20 to win that one. Great job, Mandy. Here we go. Here's our next one. In the first half of the year, we had a trophy challenge for Jumbleberry Fields and which other daily activity? <laughs> Sally just got in before there. Uh, Steven, it was really close. Sally? Wishing well. Oh. oh, oh, oh. oh. Technicality. <laughs> uh, it, Wishing well, too. Yeah, I, I'm going to give it to her. I'm going to give it to her. That's true. Wishing well, too. But yeah, I love those trophy challenges. And guys, stay tuned because we're having a few more this year. Here is our last question. What is the name of the new room theme that was released in the W Shop on May 10th? Mandy. Party time? Let's see if you're right. Yeah. Yes, Yay! you are correct. It was the party time room theme, and that is now available in the W Shop. We actually just had a vote for a new Halloween room theme that will be released in October. So, guys, stay tuned for that. So, there you go. That was the quiz. I hope everybody did really well at home. Sally is Yay! the big winner here with six points. Mandy, you have four, and Steven, you had two. And Sally, you win nothing i'm sorry i'm sorry but you have bragging rights and yeah there you go guys if you beat sally's six points let us know by leaving a comment in the section below okay guys so last night you know how i make my mistakes like the time i read the code wrong and of course last time i accidentally put the wrong picture in when we gave away <laughs> the blue polar berry pants so to make up for it, we're now actually giving you the white polar berry pants that I added the picture of last time. So, Michael, would you like to read the code for the white polar berry pants? Sure, guys. So you want to go to webkins.com um, and access the code shop from the Things to Do menu and type in this code there to get your white polar berry pants. And the code is W24BG9EXQ3L7. T-P-L-Y. So there you go. So thank you, Stephen and Sally, for joining us today. Thank you. Thanks for having me and letting me win. <laughs> <laughs>
And thank you, everybody. And thank you, Michael, of yeah. course. Yeah, thanks, guys. And uh, if you want to send us a Kins post, you just send it to podkins at gans.com. And Michael, do you want to tell us how you can subscribe to yeah, our guys, YouTube channel? You definitely want to subscribe because we have all these cool videos like the unboxing videos, room design videos, and of course, podkins. So you want to go to our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash webkins and subscribe. And of course, like all these videos, right? Right. <laughs> all right. Thanks, everyone. See you at the clubhouse. Bye. Bye. Bye.